Hey Llama here and welcome back to our next episode in our Ark Survival Ascended playthrough on the island on official PvE with the Xbox. Um, well, well, what are we doing next? Next thing, uh, honestly, so I'm sitting here on this pig because the next thing we need to do is we need to do the Alpha Broodmother. Um, I'm not super confident about this fight i'm going to use a different strategy than the used for gamma and beta uh, because i don't think that strategy will work on alpha um and we'll talk a little bit about that when we get uh, closer to the fight but um but we just had a four times weekend on official and i took that opportunity to raise some additional megatheriums um we've got some extra levels in them uh, which is fantastic so they're a little bit of a different mix of stats to the previous ones that we ran um higher health uh, and um, and I also grand out some saddles, so great time to get um, some more of those uh, high tier Megatherium saddles for them as well. Uh, and we're going to also take in the UD that we took into the monkey fight. So I have to say I'm not overly optimistic about this fight. Um, I know from experience that uh, Alpha Broodmother hits real hard. Um, the beta fight went okay. I was I was pretty pleased with how we came out of that, but I'm um, uh, yeah. I hope this different strategy works. Okay, so while we're here, let's have a look at the stats of the pig. Um, we have so this is a day on this one is imprinted. Um, so this is from a couple that I tamed, uh, and we've got uh, just under 7k health, uh, which isn't leveled. All of the levels on this one have gone into food, which is the only important stat we're worried about. And we've got 94k in food there. Um, and that will drain as we are healing things during the fight. Um, I have got a 124 saddle on it, which I got out of a drop, um, which I am going to hope that we don't need to uh, keep it alive. <laughs> All right, uh, and now the UT. Uh, so the UT. This is the one that we took in the monkey fight with us. So uh, again, not imprinted. This one is wild, uh, wild tamed, uh, but was. I think it was a 140 from memory, so it was a pretty decent level, um, and it's been leveled up to 30k health. Um, 3k stamina uh, and 419 melee might have had some points put into melee because it wasn't that high when I tamed it I remember um, and we've got a 62.4 armor saddle on this one so um, again that I grabbed out of a drop best saddle that I've got so I don't have anything better than that at the moment all right so that's uh, that's the support crew um, other than that we have the 16 megatheriums uh, now the megatheriums range uh, some of them have got up to 20k health, um, some of them have got up to like 700 melee, uh, those, I don't have any that have 20k health and 700 melee, so there's a bit of a mix, um, but uh, the ones that have got the 20k health are sitting more around the 630, 650 sort of melee um, range, but anyway, we're going to grab all those out, and uh, oh, I should say the saddles, they've got a mix of uh, the 123.5 that uh, we got from the blueprint, um, and we've got some like 121s and 120s and 90s and things like that that we got out of drops um, and obviously some 124s that we got out of drops as well so um, and some that we did uh, we craft skill crafting skilled um, some 124s uh, just while I was crafting skilling other stuff to be honest because uh, the uh, 0.5 wasn't really worth it on the saddle anyway I'm gonna get those guys out and and basically throw them out over here transfer them one by one over to the obelisk uh, and then we'll get ourselves set up for the fight all right, here we go. Alpha Broodmother. Um, I'm not overly hopeful about this after beta, I have to say. So we've got 16 Megatheriums this time. Uh, I'm not going to ride a Megatherium this time. Uh, I am going to hop between the UD and the Pig, and I'm going to try and give the Courage Roar on the UD. And hop on the pig and do some healing. And while I'm doing the healing, I'm going to be shooting the brood mother with a shotgun. And uh, hopefully, the megatherium will attack her. There is a bit of a problem with uh, the megatherium just kind of stand there and get hit. Uh, so I'm hoping that doesn't happen. Uh, we've got to try and get them all to surround her. We've got to try and get them to all get the bug buff. 
um, at the same time as roaring with the Utaranus and healing with the pig and shooting with the shotgun. Um, it's a lot to take in. And honestly, uh, I, I have a feeling <laughs> that we're going to um, lose this fight. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> I know I've said that before and come through victorious, but uh, this time I'm not so confident. All right, we've got a shotgun shells. I've got a gas mask in case uh, the um, uh, the broodmother shoots these poison balls when uh, when you hop off uh, to make sure that I don't get hit by that. We've got all of our artifacts, our tributes. Oh, we're ready to go. All right. I guess this is it. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, I have, actually, I'm gonna whistle the pig on follow, like that. Um, I've got a bit of time here. I can start courage roaring these guys before we get in the arena. Uh, I need to hop off. All right. Send them in. Now I'm going to send them in to attack the brood mother, which, which they are not doing. <laughs> All right, let's get them round here. Oh, I'm stuck on the pig. This is not good. We're not off to a good start. Now I'm going to send them over there. It seems a bit odd. And then we'll send them over to her. I'm going to do some more of this buffing stuff. Now I'm going to put them on aggressive because I want them to attack the uh, little spiders as well. And now I'm going to hop on the pig. And I'm going to try and do some healing. And while I'm doing that, I'm going to shoot her. Oh, she's taking some damage. That's a good sign. I'm seeing Megatherium just standing there. That's a bad sign. Whistle aggressive. Come on, guys. All right, we're going to get off. I'm going to get off the pig. I'm going to hop on the UD. Hop on the UD. Come on. Do some roaring. So they are doing some damage. That's good. Uh, I can't tell if they're all getting the bug buff. Oh, this pig keeps getting stuck under the Yudi's feet. I've got it on follow because obviously I don't want to leave the pig behind and have uh, too far to travel to heal. Okay, these guys are getting quite hurt. I haven't lost any yet. She's down... He's past half health. This is going better than I expected. Although, you do tend to lose them all in quick succession. Uh, food on the pig is almost gone, um, which is not good. That means, A, it's doing a lot of healing, which means a lot of stuff is getting hurt. <laughs> and it means, uh, okay, pig's done. Let's get onto the UD. We need a courage roar. We've lost a Megatherium. Okay, the Megatheriums are kind of on their own from here because we've, uh, we're at a pig heel. <laughs> we've lost another Megatherium. All right, oh, we're getting there. My God, I'll tell you what, we almost might do this. Um, we almost might do this. I think we're going to. We've... Oh, I can't believe this. 
Alpha Brood! Done! Ah! Oh, ah, oh, just the standard. Died. <laughs> well done, fellas! Oh, you all look like you're about to die. Okay, first thing, let's grab. Oh, getting stuck on things. Uh, let's grab the element and the head, because we're definitely going to need that. And let's head over here. Uh, oh, I want to grab the saddles if I can. How many did I lose? Oh, am I in the right area? I should have. Uh, I should have left them where they were, because at least. No, I'm sure it was over here. Oh, it'd be good to get the saddles. 42 seconds remaining. We've got time if I can find them. Finding a little brown bag in amongst all this stuff is not the easiest, to be fair. Thought the fighting all happened here. But no, we're not going to get. We're not even going to get one. <laughs> I know there are two bags, at least two. I think more um, with saddles. But oh, you know what? We didn't get them. Oh, I don't care. I can't believe we did that. Yeah, 300 health. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, we lost three. We lost three. Oh, we lost Bagon. Ah. Uh, okay, what? Well, that, that wasn't bad. Oh, I can breathe now. Uh, that wasn't actually that bad. Um, let's get... I'm going to get all the pods... I'm going to pod these guys. Oh, I really do need to breathe. Um, oh, I didn't bring the pods with me. I, there you go. I was that um, certain that we weren't going to survive that fight. I didn't even take the cryopods with me. <laughs> so bring them back. <laughs> I was not expecting anything to come back. I thought I'd just spawn back in the bed after I die. <laughs> oh, I should have had more faith in the crew, shouldn't I? There we go. All right, here we are back at base. Well, yep, those um, that was a tough fight. Those uh, a lot of those megatheriums took a lot of damage. So uh, I'm looking for uh, we we almost lost. I reckon uh, when I went back and looked at the health stats afterwards, I reckon another under another minute and we would have lost another ten uh, easily. Um, so uh, and because the pig, the pig was out of uh, health as well, so. Or out of food, I hate to say. Healing. So, yeah, that was a closer fight than it may have looked. Um, now, I'm looking to do something fairly low uh, stress. <laughs> so, we know there's um, these new animated series Explorer notes out. Um, so, I thought I'd head off and go and get the first one of those. Uh, and I think it's... Oh, it's wrong map. Let's pull this map up so I think it's around oh okay around here on this little island thing so let's head over there and see if we can find it all right I think we're coming over to it now um oh it's I tell you what, I will be so glad to see this fog go when we get to Scorched Earth. Uh, now, I feel like it's here. Um, I did look up the coordinates and I knew, I know it was roughly in this spot. Uh, let's have a look, see, if, I think it's a little bag. Let's see if we can find it. Ah, there it is. That's it there little satchel nice uh, while we're holding the cryopod okay so this is uh, let's just I'll show you the coordinates uh, 90.4 12.6 um, on the corner of is this Crags Island I think let's have a look 
Craig's Island. Yes, it is. Okay. Dear Jane, you're probably not going to be seeing me around the 4th of July picnic after all. Sure wish I'd gotten around to writing before now, because I doubt there's mail service home from wherever it is I found myself. Some tropical island in God knows where. That's not me trying to keep secrets. I figure you must have heard by now that I never made it ashore in Normandy anyway. Nope, no ratsies here. But just about everyone and everything else is trying its damnedest to kill me. Get this, there are living, breathing dinosaurs on this island. I can guess what you must be thinking right about now. Bobby's gone clear off his rocker. But I'm writing you hand on heart. Swear on my dear mama's grave. Somehow, those things are still walking around here. Just as alive as I am. Makes about as much sense as me finding this handmade camera and typewriter just lying around on the beach. But maybe these picture postcards will prove I ain't making any of this up. They do say seeing's believing, right? Anyway, I'm still trying to work it all out myself. But I promise you, I'm gonna find a way home. And picnic or not, we'll make some fireworks together when I do. I'll write you again soon, Jane. But just now, I think I hear a dinner sore clucking in the bushes. I'm so hungry, Bob. P.S. Tell Bill he still owes me that 20 from the big New Year's poker game. And we ain't waiting till 1945 to collect. Hmm. Well, there we go. Right. And we've got the second one. The second one was released just today. So maybe we'll go and have a look at the second one. What uh, what did we get? So we unlocked... Uh, did we already have that one? No, oh, I don't know. Uh, we unlocked Helena Walker skin and a generic skin skin. <laughs> okay. That's, uh, that's Bob, by the looks of it. Uh, and a dodo costume. I assume I can't wear the dodo costume. No, I can, in fact, be Bob. Uh, okay. Or I can be Helena, but I keep my own hair. That's a little disturbing. I'm, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> That's not too bad. <laughs> uh, all right. Hmm, not a bad look, actually. Let's see if we can find the second note, shall we? Okay, I have it on reasonably good authority, the second note's down here. But we've got someone's built a base there, so... Hmm. Okay, well, I bet it's in the water. Yeah, we might not be able to find this one if someone's built on top of it. Here's the second note. Okay. So this one is, let's have a look, 82.6, 34.7. All right. Let's have a look at this one. Now, Jane, before you get all wound up about me spending time with some castaway girl, let me just say, you got nothing to worry about on that score. It's more like when your folks used to make us take your know-it-all kid sister along with us everywhere. You know, a real pain in the ass. She just washed up on my beach, and boy, does it show. Doubt the girl would last half a day on this island if I wasn't here to babysit her. She's too damn soft. The very first time I saw her, she kept me from catching some squab for dinner. And suddenly I've got some brat lecturing me about how her precious new pet's the last of its kind. Wants me to take her seriously, like she's some kind of expert. All she has to do is look around. I mean, those fat little birds are all over the place here. I haven't even told you the nuttiest part. How she claims to be from the future? At least she says the good guys won. Which means you stayed safe and sound stateside. Either way, I thought I'd better show the girl what we're dealing with here. Man-eating monsters, floating sky things, the whole nine yards. 
that maybe I shouldn't have rushed her. She's been just staring at all of it. Long enough for me to take her picture and write you this note. But don't worry. I promise I won't let her slow me down too much. Nothing's keeping me from getting back to your home cooking. Save me some, baby. Bob. Well, there we go. There's the two, first two Dear Jane notes unlocked. And the locations. All right, let's uh, head back to base. All right, let's try out some of these animated costumes, shall we? We've got... Uh, we've got a parasaur. We have a parasaur. Pretty sure this one's probably the same as the previous parasaur costume. Uh, let's see, here we go. Yeah, I think it looks the same. All right, what else did we get? So we got a Rex costume and a Raptor costume. Oh, I don't think I've got a Raptor. Uh, let's have a look. Definitely got a Rex. That won't be a problem. Let's throw out a Rex. Can we do that in here? Yeah, we should be able to. Oh, yes, they are multicolored Rexes. Well, this will uh, this will bland them down a bit. There we go. Pop the costume on. And oh wow, they keep their color. Well, that's interesting. Okay, that is interesting. That's pretty cool. So they actually keep their colors applied to the animation. Oh, I did not realize that. There you go. Uh, okay, what else do we have? Did we tame a dodo? I'm not even sure. Did. Uh, let's. Why don't we just search? Dodo? No, we did not. And we don't have a raptor either. Alright, I'll tell you what. Let's gonna try some of these other ones so we have what's this we have may in okay and we still keep the hair I don't know, I'm still I'm still not sure how I feel about that is that because I've hidden my hat let's see uh, if I go show hat aha there we go okay may in uh apparently this is also may in but that kind of looks to me like it's rockwell <laughs> so i'm assuming that that's uh that's an error <laughs> uh okay uh then we got helena of course so that looking a little bit better now she's not got my hair um and bob uh again looking well actually do you know what i think i preferred him with my hair uh, let's go and go hide hat and go back like that. I actually prefer that. I think that's a better look. Uh, right then. Now uh, we have the raptor and the dodo yet to try. So we've got a little bit of taming to do. Okay. So the raptor takes simple kibble and the dodo takes basic kibble, neither of which I have. So I'm just going to use regular kibble, which I have plenty of. Uh, and I'm going to grab some drink dots. Let's have a look over here. Probably going to end up killing the dodo with drink dots to be fair. Uh, oh, 29. Bucket loads. All right, let's go looking for a raptor and or a dodo. Is that a normal raptor? It is. Hey, buddy. Yeah. Oh, we're lagging. 
Hmm? All right. Well, you're right. How about that? Okay. Yep, that killed him. Uh, right, Raptor. Where's the Raptor? Come on. Over here. How much kibble are you going to require, I wonder, for a level 20? Can't be that much, surely not. Give it two. I mean, we're on one time, so... Let it eat one and then see where that gets us. Ah, oh, yeah, two's, two's enough. Two's plenty. All right, so there's our raptor. All right, there is our raptor. Zeno, there's a Gigantoraptor. I wonder what level that is. I don't know, it's angry. Level 50. An angry boy. Oh, I don't know. Could it be true? What the hell's that? Oh no, there's the Gigantoraptor's followed us. Oh, go away. Alright, I'm going to have to kill this. Honestly. Can't believe I could kill that because I need to tame a dodo. Is that it? Is anything else coming to get me? Alright, let's try and make this as... Short, swear. I killed it? Really? Okay, that, <laughs> that must have been a headshot. That's why. <laughs> Should have done a body shot. Oh no. That was the one. Oh, there's one. There's one. Oh, there's one there. Oh, they're everywhere. Okay. Come on. Body shot. Okay, you're unconscious. Thank goodness for that. That's something at least. Only level 25, so I'm going to give it one kibble. And hope that that's enough. How much kibble could it take to tame a level 25 dodo? Surely not much. Hey, there's the dodo. Alright, so we've got to try and get that. Diplo's going to nudge us. Gonna get on the... Yay, there we go. We've tamed a dodo. Now, let's check out the dodo skin first. Go. Alright, fair enough. Well, here's what it is. It's a dodo. And the raptor. Well, there we go. Alright, what a uh, dubious looking crew they are. Oh, the dodo's on follow still. Well, there we go. I think we're going to end that video there. So we managed to defeat the Alpha Broodmother, much to my surprise, uh, I have to say. So uh, so that was good. Uh, tick that one off. Uh, we've unlocked the Tech Helmet, um, probably the most valuable piece uh, out of the Alpha Broodmother set. 
Um, we now have, so that's uh, Gamma Beta Alpha Brood, Gamma Beta Alpha Monkey. We now have to tackle the dragon. So we haven't done any of the dragon fights yet. Um, that's what we'll be dealing with next. And we've unlocked all the animated skins. So I had a quick look at them on the two current Explorer notes. And I think there's a couple more of those to come before Scorched Earth drops and then after, if I'm to believe uh, wild card are going to stick to their deadlines <laughs> so let's see shall we um so i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you got something out of it um if you did drop me a like maybe subscribe if you haven't and uh, i'll see you in the next video i'm llama and i'm out of here <laughs>